Oh yeah. I'm outside. We're about to paint this. Got certain areas taped off here. Don't want to get paint in them. And I've got the Rust-Oleum. Some flat black. It's supposed to be good stuff. I don't know. We're going to find out. So I'm going to do a build, essentially, of the guitar that never got shipped to me. So I'm excited to kind of right or wrong and correct that. And wanted to vlog this to keep a process going so we could check it out. So I'm just going to paint this, let it dry, and paint some more. I don't know. Looks pretty cool so far. It's going to be some touch up involved, of course, but. Kind of get the parts I see that are clearly some pooled up excess paint. Make sure I rub it the right way here to. I think I'm gonna use that pallet that my bench got set on because you know what? I am not gonna use that thing. I was gonna throw it away anyways. Let me wipe off the camera. If you wanna know who I voted for for president, right there, Optimus Prime for president. All right, I think that's it for the top. I'm gonna let that dry for a while. I'll turn this back on later. Hi, wanted to do a quick guitar update here. So I'm not quite as far as I wanted to be learning a little bit. Never really painted a guitar. I probably should have gotten an actual primer instead of a paint with a primer. So I've had to put several coats on before it started to get even. Um, messed a couple spots up, had to sand some areas also, it's been really rainy for a stretch, and since I have to work exclusively outside and, and not in a climate-controlled uh, environment, the paint's been taking longer to dry, so man, between coats, it needs a lot of time to dry. The company I bought the guitar components from and the body and the neck, the neck is still being built. The body was in stock. They forgot to ship some of the hardware, so I didn't get as far for two reasons. Uh, little painting problems and I didn't have all the hardware to install the components I wanted so at this point in time I'm stalled I don't really don't have anything else to show you I was hoping to be able to show you more by this Wednesday but alas I don't so next Wednesday I've got the correct parts coming um, it wasn't my fault it was an error on their end but 
everything's gonna be a-okay. It's just some screws, but I can't put on certain hardware without the right fasteners, so I need them. And no, you know, no big deal. I'd, it'd take a lot to kind of make me angry. No one was purposely sabotaging my order. They're humans, they make mistakes. I make mistakes at work. You make mistakes at work. We, we make mistakes, so I don't hold it against anybody. Minor inconvenience anyways. It's gonna take probably another month for them to get the neck completed, so I've got some time. But I was hoping to be able to show more, and unfortunately I don't have anything else to show anyways. I'm going to cut this video here. This is going to be the end of that. I wanted to do a quick vlog about the, the guitar build so far. And, uh, you know, it's, it's been fun. I think next time when I do this, and I definitely plan on doing it again, I'll, I'll have a better understanding of what to do when I paint and better techniques and different things. And so, yeah, I'm, I'm super stoked. Hopefully next week I get to show you more. I think I'm going to get to show you more next week. Do the electronics, get the bridge the tremolo piece put in, the electronics installed. It's going to be super cool. And then we just got to wait for the neck. So until next time, peace.